All right, here we have a classic Tori the Fan Man box fan comparison, if you will. These are two Lakewood fans. The one on the left is a Lakewood Model 227 from 1999, or 1998, I should say. And the one on the left, or on the right, is a Lakewood Model 225 RG from 2003. Both are pretty interesting fans, in my opinion. You don't see these at all anymore. Um, but yeah, we're going to do a... I'm going to go over the differences here. It's pretty much an episode of different but the same, if you will. I haven't done one of those in a while. This one has the turquoise seven-wing blade. This one has the blue five-wing blade. Both of them are braced, as you can see. There and there. This one... Well, let's look at the similarities first. They both have the same handle, thermostat, three speeds. Thermostat, three speeds. This one has the extra sticker because it was left over from the 90s ones. Now these both share a very similar aspect to another model Lakewood made, which is one of these. A 1996 Lakewood 223. This is pretty much the successor to this, if you will. I don't know if we'll be able to scoot it over enough here. But they all use the same cabinet. That's the 2003 right here. This is 1996. They used this from 1988 on the way up to, I guess, 03. So yeah, in a way, these are a successor to this. If you will. <clears throat> Take a look at the differences. Which there isn't a whole lot, honestly. That separates the two. Aside from the blades, we got back grills are very different. The whole cord setup is very different. The one on the left here is the motor vents all opened up with no blocking or no boombox cord. Cord comes out down here like they should. This one has the vent covered up. I guess they did change the back grill a little bit. This one has more vents up here. And they put the boombox cord on it. But what's weird is the cord hole is still down here for... from those models. <sighs> Kinda odd. They both weigh about the same. I believe this one's heavier. This one does have the stand holes still. Well, this one does not. So anyway, I have to start them off on low. Now airflow on low anyway, it's pretty much the same. Not gonna lie, it's pretty much the same on low. This one might move a little bit more air. It's about the same. I think that one moves more air, just a little bit more. And we'll head up to medium. Now in medium you kind of notice a little bit more of a difference. This one's moving a lot more air. It's a better stream of air anyway. 
This one's moving a little bit less air. But both are pretty much the same. Make sure that stands up. Lastly, high speed. And you're probably wondering, this one's loud as hell. That one's not as bad. Which one moves the most air on high? I'd say this one, honestly. That one's... Eh, not too bad. And... Thermostat. They both have the pilot lights. This one's a lot quieter than this one. I'm gonna shut it off. So yeah, there we go. The comparison I've been kind of wanting to do for a while. Kind of glad I got to it finally. Coast down's about the same. So yeah, there you go. The Lakewood 227. And the Lakewood 225. Hope you enjoyed. <clears throat> and thank you for watching.